What's going on everybody, I'm YouTube's ProBJ and welcome back to This Is The Police 2. When we left off, the sheriff got killed. So now, we're trying to figure out what this guy knows. Um, Tell me who pulled the trigger and I might let you go. Even if I knew what you were talking about, I wouldn't tell you. Now how about a kiss, all cops around here got lips sweet as yours. He's a bit creepy. He's a bit creepy. As I understand, you never kept drugs at your base. I'm not leaving until you tell me where your hideout is. Sure, fine. You win. It's at uh, 69 Dick. Go check it out. Uh, you'll love it. Ah, ah, white guy, eh? She looks so defeated. <laughs> she so, looks so At defeated. Least hide the suitcase. What? Oh, this? It's just Charlie. Shut your trap and get ready to question the suspect. Exactly. I don't. I'm still up in the air about this because there's a lot more cutscenes in this one, and I'm not. I'm not sure whether I like it. I like the gameplay of the last game, and I'm not getting a lot of gameplay here. You understand that, right? I know, Lily. I know. I need to finish writing that letter to Captain Carter. Ah, yes, the letter. He looks very, he, he might be, he might be in on this. He looks a little dodgy, if I do say so myself. And I am a master. I am a master cop. Not really. I feel like this all happened last time. Is this about the toilet? Hello, my name is Bogdan. Uh -huh. Are you satisfied with your Yeah, I did all this. System? Why is it making me do I it again? Not. I did all this. I'm a skip, 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 because we already went through this and I don't want to sit through it again. Did we get this far? I think we might. Did we get this far? God, I can't. I don't remember where the fuck we got up to. Ain't nothing like a good old whiskey. Ah, yeah, yeah. Dear children. <laughs> Dear Dylan, Oliver, and Edgar. No, I did go through all this. I did go through all this. Is it true what they're saying about you? Uh, my only goal is taking care of myself and my family. I trust the wrong people. I did all this. Why is it making me repeat? What the fuck? I'm trying to like speed through this so that we don't, um, just so that uh, we're not having to run. Um, so we don't have to run through the exact same stuff that we did last time. Uh, okay. Sure. I'm trying to remember what I did. I'm trying to remember, um... You know, I'm trying to remember what, 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 uh, answers I gave for this so I can keep it as authentic to the gameplay that I was doing. I'm sorry that it's been like a, a, almost two weeks since I did this. Um... Uh, okay, there we go. I do remember this because that piano guy's still going crazy. Alright. Okay, there we go. Did you kill people? Well, not. Yeah. How's my elf? I see I feel bad because I feel like Jack's gonna die in this game, man. You know, I'm You 
Yeah. Why don't you just retire? Okay, I think I think we're slightly back up to where we were. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Won't get the chance to explain myself. What am I planning next? Uh Uh Uh, sure. Here we go. Now we're back up, I think. I think we're caught back up. Oh, is he sending money back to his family? What a good mate. Jack, you're good mate. I like you. There's a reason I like Jack. Ha, we could hardly shut the guy up. It wasn't so tough. I didn't even get to the phase three. <laughs> phase three is where we don't have a lot of time. They're moving their headquarters, but we should be able to nab most of them if we hurry. Okay. Up here, the old summer camp, but they never keep the goods at their headquarters. They always use a different place, usually an isolated house on the outskirts. Okay. Most of the time, these places have random tenants who don't even suspect that there's anything hidden under their floorboards. Oh, this that is way, right, because they be they, they the suspected an old guy, which I'm drugs. guessing is going to be Remember Jack. That little tavern called Forsetti? We went drinking there after graduation and broke I that do big guess, I, I guess that they're going to infiltrate like house, Jack's, and now he Jack's house, house or something. Nothing. Two weeks ago, an old man moved in. There we go. Under his floorboards, there's 27 kilograms of heroin. Mm. I'm starting to that's think some that guy good, is going uh, to mess around by the next time. That's a, that's a good quality. I shit my dad. But you said it's a small place, right? Well, I bet there's two at least. I don't believe they just left the stuff under some old man's floorboards. Even uh, if there is an old man living there, uh, I bet can he's take in take care it. of your... Maybe old man is just a nickname. What do you yes, think? Uh, I bet he's a right cutthroat. Hunkered down there. Ready to ambush us. Maybe he already... Well, you and Corey, go check it out. Take yeah. two cars in case it's not just an old man yeah, living Corey. in the house. Whoever you find there... Go down there, bitch. In. And don't forget about the heroin. Yeah, the rest don't, of you will come with don't forget about the heroin, doors. man. Sound good to you, Lily? Don't forget about it. Oh, uh, yes. That sounds mighty fine to me. Lily doesn't speak much. <laughs> I'll speak for her. This is where we were. Drug trafficking. Hey. Ah, yeah, we do get the old gameplay back. Yeah. Nice. I like this gameplay. This gameplay is cool. I miss this. Ah, oh, God. The flashbacks, the memories, man. The memories of the first game that are flooding back to me right now. Oh my god. He's like drunk and just <laughs> passed out on the couch or something. Yes. Who is it? <laughs> Uh oh. Sheriff's Department. <laughs> Get I might. Ah, uh, no. No. No, no, no. Look at this. What? Ah, uh, no, well, just look, Corey. Hey. You couldn't find anyone better to watch the goods? Well, what they goods? just didn't bother. Or are we missing something? What do you think, Corey? Think we're missing something? Huh? Do you not know who I am, really? Is some kind of special meaning to the fact that we've got drunk, dirty grandpa here, sitting in the shack, watching the goods? Excuse me? Maybe we me? need to crack the code here, huh? Don't well, call me ideas? dirty grandpa. Where they hid the powder? How about you look around while I... <laughs> while I interrogate the suspect, huh? Jackie, you can tell him who you are. That's gonna be good. 
You. What's your name, old man? <laughs> Tell him the truth. Boy. What did you say, old man? You need to answer nice and clear when a police officer speaks to you. Oh, oh I'm a police is, officer. Uh, Nash. Uh, Warren Nash. I'll tell you something, okay. Warren Nash. Fifteen years I get on the force. I get it. He doesn't, all wanna, sorts of dirty he doesn't want to be uh, exposed. This town isn't exactly upscale, in case you haven't noticed. I've caught thieves, caught rapists, murderers, and drug traffickers. All part of the job, you know? I'm doing my job. Nice and easy. Like yeah, by holding a gun to my head? What the but fuck? here you are. This, this filth, you're, you don't make it easy you're, I'm not to hurt, you're talking to that, Sonny Jim. like you drives me up the wall. With scum like you, I can't, I, I just can't keep up the cold-blooded professional attitude. I God, just I, can't. The camera shake it. You know camera why, God, Warren? Please. Because. Keep it still. Oh, I'm sorry, Warren. I'll be just a second, all right? Oh, thank you. Thanks, sir. Oh, shit. shit. Charlie! What the hell? Do you want- Corey, to... just look for the fucking drugs while I'm busy with the fucking suspect, okay? It's like so a weird Corey, version of the Joker or something. Like you, you drive me nuts. You just gotta look for Because you think that we'll never catch up with you. You, you, know, you, you think just the police can't do anything. You think we just rescue cats from trees and help old old ladies carry their bags up to the porch. You, yes. You think, you believe, you really- <laughs> Really believe that we'll never get to you, so you don't even have to try. You taking good care of the goods yeah. here, Warren? You ready for us here, Warren? Just waiting in ambush, Are you Warren? you ready for us here, Warren? You did Warren. fucking nothing, Warren! Fucking nothing! Because you thought we'd never come. But Cameraman, here I am, Warren. Shaking. Here please. I am! What are you gonna do now, Warren? What's the big plan, Warren? Hey, please tell me you hit him. Found something. You hear that, Warren? He found something. Next time, hide it better. Ow. You feckers. Well, this looks like 27 keys of heroin to you. I... I would say there's somewhere between 26 and 28 keys. Yeah. Well, well, th well that sounds like 27, right? <sighs> yep. Yeah. Yep, looks like 27. So what are we thinking here? You load it up in the car and I'll pack up the old man. Excuse me? We might need. How dare you, sir? I am an officer of the law. I am Jack. I mean, you don't know that, but still. Sheriff, please. Please, Sheriff. Gotta believe. Uh, like, uh, I need, I, uh, I really need to talk to the sheriff as soon as possible. Yep. I'm Sheriff Reed. You can talk all you like, but if I were you, I'd wait for my lawyer, Mr. Nash. I don't. Uh, you, you said you're the sheriff. That's what I said. I uh, no no, I'm just. I are you Sharpwood Sheriff? I'm the sheriff. You, She's uh, the sheriff. You could... Do you have the authority to... Look, I'm wearing a shiny star on my chest. I'm sitting here in the middle of the night, and even though I'm exhausted, I'm poring over murder files that no one else wants to bother with. So, yeah, I'm the sheriff. Yeah, I sounds pretty sheriffy. This, and I'm not sure I ever will be, but I don't have another sheriff for you, Mr. Nash. You might as well accept it. Listen, Sheriff... Uh, uh, sheriff Reed, This right? is gonna be weird. Great, Sheriff Reed. Uh... I need to talk to the sheriff, and and you're the sheriff, so so it's even better. I, I mean, older sheriffs sometimes. Well, that doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I'm not. I'm not talking about that. I. Uh, I just want to say that there's been a mistake. Yes, a big and mistake. And I want to help you out here because I. Yeah, because there uh, was a huge batch of cocaine hiding in your house. You want me to believe oh, you didn't know anything hey. about it? I hey, rent that house. Only lived there a couple of weeks, and you... You know all that, right? It's easy to check, huh? Yeah, it's... Uh, uh, but but that's not important. It's, it's, it's not, not that I, uh, I... 
I'm trying. Listen, Sheriff Reed, you, you have to listen Jack, to me seriously. very carefully. Just get to the fucking I'm point. I'm a policeman, just like you, you know? Oh, so you must be undercover. Is that it, Mr. Nash? No, 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 that's... It's much more complicated than that. Yeah, a lot more My name is Warren Nash. I, yeah, I already knew that. Your fake documents are so bad, they practically fell apart in my hands. If cool. You, if you let me explain, I... Would you like to see my real document, Sheriff? Look, that humidor, you see it? What? That little box, the, the little wooden box on the table, see? Yeah, that's, that's Looks it. Looks like a jewelry box? It's locked. We'll crack it open in the morning. Well, wouldn't you rather open it now? Please, Sheriff Reed, let's open it now, and, and I'll try to explain everything. Yeah. I'm in a very difficult situation, and I'm asking you to listen to me. Just open the box, and you'll find my passport in there. My real passport. Yep. My name's Jack Boyd. The documents that say I'm Warren Nash, I bought them for 90 bucks at the rail station. Yep. Please, just open the box, and I'll explain everything. Please. You say you were a cop, huh? Yes. 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 I, I was a cop. I, I was the chief of police, just like you. Look, it's a very long and complicated story, but I... It is. I it's it's very you, complicated. It's just a huge misunderstanding. And, and the fact I that I'm into hiding God here, damn it. The fact that I'm here at all, it's... Uh, God damn it. It's an injustice Even that dumb I want to correct. And I'm asking you to help Please. me. Even dumbass price. Is she going to take the key and be like, we'll see you in the morning? Don't be a dick. Come on. Help a sister out. Come on. Okay. Come on, she's got to believe me now. Sheriff. Sheriff Reed, let's talk. I'm begging you. God damn it, Jack. God dang it. Okay, so she's matching it up. Sheriff Reed, let me... Do you even know what you've been accused of, Mr... Mr. Boyd? I, a little let's bit. Just say I, you know, bits and pieces here and there. I don't know if you know there. what happened in Freeburg last winter, but it had nothing to do with the law or justice. I was used. You and I, do understand that I have to report you to the feds, right, Mr. Oh, Boyd? Oh, come Reed, if you do this, you, you just continue this. I think, I believe that cops should help each other, so I just want to say... <laughs> You seem like the kind of person We've who... Known each yeah, other Jack, for five you, minutes, you're digging Mr. yourself into a bit of a hole there, mate. I've made any impression on you at all. Whatever you've got yourself mixed up in, I hope that... I hope that you find justice, if that's really what you want. But for now... But while I... For now, all I know is this. You're a criminal, and they're looking for you. Yeah? Your... Your folder. Your folder. That's a case file. Can, can I see it? Excuse me? I worked as a detective for years. Even when I was chief, I did half of my detective's work. If you... There we go. If you're having trouble with the case, I'm sure I can help. Cops should help each other. My exact words, oh, right? Jack's trying to... He's, he's smart. He's kind of smart. I, I like it. Sheriff Reed, what do you have to lose? You're the head of this police department. You've got to think rationally. I'm not trying to teach you how to do your work. I'm just... Well, just for a minute, forget about all that, the other. This whole awkward situation, okay? Right? You have an unsolved murder, and there's someone standing right in front of you who's offering to help. Maybe I'm an imposter, yeah. and I can't actually do anything. Maybe I'll even turn out to be a lunatic, scatter the file around the cell, and dance around like a wild monkey. But maybe, <laughs> just maybe, really inspiring I really confidence, am an experienced Jack. cop who can help you find your killer. Don't you want that? Don't you want to give me a chance since you've got nothing to lose? Don't I'd you agree want a with real that. criminal in prison, not some sorry victim of circumstance like me? 
That's police work. Catching the real criminals, right? Wow, he actually he actually sold me on that, man. <laughs> I was pretty sold on that. I'm going crazy. All right. To solve the crime, you'll need to reconstruct the picture of what happened. Okay. An empty house and butchered. Hmm. Okay, let's do it. Proceed. He bur Oh, I remember these. I remember these. That goes there. 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 Oh, the victim's wife. Oh. Well, that changes everything. Kind of. Just drags that in. No. She doesn't. He's an asshole at dinner. Asks for a beer. She pulls out a knife. She slits his throat. She drags him out. Maybe. Let's read. I was at the neighbor's to borrow some salt. I heard the TV. There was something... Some crazy maniac started killing... Journalists nicknamed him the wrestler because he wears a wrestling mask. I don't pay attention to the news, but I remember because I was leaving, I noticed a Latino in the street with a sports bag, and he was taking off his mask. I got home, and there was blood everywhere, and Bob was nowhere to be found. Okay. Came over to borrow salt. It's funny. Grocery shopping. Blah, 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 blah. Sat for a while. Going back. Don't know how to put it. Typical man. He was always walk around with in a stupid t-shirt. Spent the entire day staring at the TV and yelling. Okay. Okay. Ruth decided to go vegetarian. She read a magazine. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Bathroom is covered in blood. It looks like there was a victim's corpse. Okay. Neatly laid on the counter. Okay. Throat was slashed. I think I got all the information I need here. He would walk around. I kind of ah. Uh, oh no, because of the pig's head. It's got to be the wife got to be right so if I move all of this here right that there that there oh not even that there that there that there that there Um, vegetable soup. Uh, enters carrying garbage bag. Then the garbage bag, and then they squabble over soup. She approaches with a knife, slashes him, corpse in a tub with a cleaver? How? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how this all fits. I really don't. 
Okay. Carrying a sports bag. Maybe he's watching Bob and then looks in. And then approaches Bob, slashes his throat, cuts him. Oh God, I don't know. God. Medical examiner. In one single confident motion, death came almost instantly. There's no signs of a struggle on the body. The corpse was dismembered after the death. <sighs> okay. Hacksaw. I think it's the wife. I really do. There might be a shit thing to say, but... I think it could have been. I really do. Uh, what do I do when I'm happy with it? I mean, I probably haven't got the right one, but hey. Okay. 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 Let's think about this again. Let's squabble over the soup. She hands him a beer. She pulls the knife. She stabs him. Or maybe we bring all this up here. Quebec. Uh, okay. God, I don't know. It's hard. It's really hard. Okay, um, he got that, did that. What if he did all this and then snuck out? Like that's him shutting the door. And what if hers, right, ends with her walking out? Maybe this is not her walking forward, this is her walking out. Starts with the fight, then she kills him. I'm a fucking genius. Um, I don't know. Because of the pig, because of the pig and everything, it kind of makes me lean towards the wife a little bit. Because of the pig and everything, it makes me kind of think that it's her. I really do think it's her. Look. Because of the pig head and everything, I feel like it's her. Because, like, she was all against animal cruelty and a bunch of other stuff, so... I seriously think it's a wife. Lily, are you there? Come on, Lily. Lily. Trust me, I'm a jack of boy. Lily here. Come in. Can you grab the box of flashbang grenades and get over here? No. There's no time to lose. No, I cannot. Lily. Copy. I'm on my way. Uh, you welcome? Well, what can I say except you're welcome? You fucking asshole. Alright. You know what? We just solved our first case. I think that's the perfect place to leave it for today, man. That was a good first ever Second episode, sorry. God, first episode. Jesus. Um, that was a good second episode, man. Great place to leave it. Great first case, actually. So, um, it'll be interesting to see whether she accepts... Jack onto the force. I'm kind of tipping towards she will. Um, otherwise, we're not going to really have a game here, are we? So, we'll see what happens. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this second episode of This is the Police 2. 
If you did, let me know by giving me a big thumbs up. Don't forget to comment and don't forget to subscribe if you're not already, guys. It helps me out a lot. There are links to my social medias in the description box. And as always, there's a link to popyjn.com down below. Popyjn.com, of course, is your one-stop shop for everything PopyJM related. All of the upcoming live events. All of the merch, everything is over at popyjn.com, including our premium content service. Uh, for $4 a month, you get access to multiple hours of additional content not found here on the YouTube channel. Usually $4 a month, but if you sign up for right now, you get one month absolutely free. So you can check it out, enjoy it. That is popyjn.com. But thank you guys. I hope you're having a fantastic day wherever you are in the world. And until next time. I'm YouTube's Poppy Jan. Peace out. Good night.